guys, it's your girl Kimberly Jessica reporting in live today from iHeartRadio. And I'm here with none other than my fellow veteran sister, Dr. Felicia. We got together along with our other friend, Claudine, and of course, T. Marie, who this is literally her signature brand, the Black Queens Matter, out here in Los Angeles, flexing today. So we are so excited because we put this event together with T. Marie and Dr. Felicia. Dr. Felicia's here. I'm going to interview Claudine afterwards. And so, Dr. Felicia, tell us a little bit about you and, and what, what, what you do and what brought you to Black Queens matter like two seconds okay so um i'm originally from uh, gary indiana i'm here by way of the military and right now i work here with the department of defense i work with vets military families and children black Queens matter is a vision something that i've wanted to uh, be a part of through t marie because i followed her for years and she's absolutely amazing phenomenal phenomenal and so i'm here to unit with the unification of black yes. Queens and all that we represent wow well thank you and so how can we get in touch with you i mean do you have a non-profit or something I have, you want to promote i do have a non-profit you can get in contact with me through uh, the non-profit which is called betish b-e-t-i-s-a Betish for veterans. Okay, cool. Now we're gonna walk on over and we're gonna chat okay. with Claudine. Okay. And we're gonna then go around and talk to the different black queens and ask them how they're loving this. Thank you. All right, thank you. Okay, guys, we're heading on over to our good friend, uh, Claudine. Hi, Claudine. We're here with iHeartRadio. We just want to interview you, talking about the Black Queens Matter, learning a little bit about you and what you have going on so we can promote that. So here we are with Goddess. Claudine, here you are, Chica. She's real pretty, too. You guys should see her. Like, so pretty. Thank you so much, love. I appreciate the time. And thank you. Ask me anything you want to ask me. Tell me a little bit about you, Claudine. You're the mystery girl. You get it done, but you're a mystery. You want to know about the mystery. The mystery. Yes. Well, yes, I do get a lot done in a lot of different areas. Um, Currently out in L.A. I'm from New York. Nice. And, um... I told T when I came out here, I wanted to bring the black queens out here, and I knew she wanted us all to get together, and literally within a matter of days, we pulled this all together. We pulled it together. She killed it, y'all. <laughs> no, She's we, being modest. We killed it. And so, um, for me, it's all about growth and, and, and helping us. I'm a very spiritual person. Wonderful. And, um, and I'm... I think that my purpose here in life is just to share the light. I love that. And you are a light, my dear. <laughs> Thank you, my it's love. Dreaming. Thank you. And, and and that's just that's what I'm here to do. And so for me, just putting together an event like this with such beautiful women, a lot of positive energy, is just so important. And the other day when we talked, you asked me what I do. And the one thing that I never mentioned is about events. Because to me, events is all about bringing people together. And, and, and that's why I love doing things like this. Um, even though right now I'm in California for different reasons, I'm still running my event business. And, and what that's about is just gathering friends, gathering family, gathering people, gathering community. And when we do that, we all grow. And it's so important. It helps your soul, you know, to expand. Yes. And, and, and just just having this room and this space with all of these beautiful women in here, you can feel the energy, right? Everybody's just happy, excited. And, and, and a lot of times what happens is, is events, food is served, right? It's all about it the food. Brings it brings us together. And that's what we do. No matter even the culture, you're breaking down walls. That's exactly. What you do. Exactly. You know what you do? You break down walls and bring people together. <laughs> Some is the right up. Thank you. you Break down walls and barriers. You got Panamanians in here. You got Trinidadians in here. Black women from every diaspora together, loving on each other. That's what it's about. That's what you do. I'm passionate. Yo tengo pasión. I'm passionate about this, man. I'm Panamanian. You know, you got the passion. And this beautiful, the other sister over there is Trinidadian. We got mothers in here. Look at y'all. We got spiritual mothers in here. You know what I'm saying? That no things, spiritual mothers that'll bless you. Okay? I see women in here that will bless your soul just by looking at you. Just by putting their hands on you. They can heal you. This is what it's about. Bringing the crone together. God, you're going to get me going because your light is bright. Yes, ma'am. Thank you for doing this. Thank Absolutely. You I wanted to salute you publicly. I believe in letting everybody know the great things. Because people like to talk and talk and talk. They don't talk about the good stuff. You forgot that part. You know, people be like, oh, she did all this stuff, but you forgot the part where you're sleeping on my couch and wearing my clothes and eating my food. You forgot all about that. That too. That too, but we won't even mention it like you did. 
We just mentioned it. <laughs> so, yeah, we thank you. We love you. You are recognized. We see what you do, and God sees what you did. And that's why he's got you here right now on the radio talking about your business to 10 million viewers. Because you did throw your bread on water. And what happens when you throw bread on water? It swells. Well, this is the blessing. It's swelling over. Right? Amen. I see this powerful sister here. Her energy is just magnificent. We're talking to you from iHeartRadio. How you doing today? Oh, really? From yes, ma'am. I like that I idea. like you. Oh, my God. Yeah. That's Tell me a little bit station. about you. Yes, WKIM FM 61.1 in Los Angeles, iHeartRadio. Kimberly hey, Jessica. Hey, everybody. You That's know what, what? I'm going to give a shout out to Amen. Mississippi. Come on now. You know, there's so many people is suffering right now. Okay. And I want them to know that you guys are in our prayers. Amen. And we're hoping for the best. You Amen. know what? This is not nice, but don't give up and don't give in because you will build again. Amen. And you need to fight for righteousness and fight for what you need. That's right. Because you got to stick together. It ain't Amen. no dividing because no. you will fall. You will fall. I don't care what color you are. That you got to come together yes. because all lives matter, and especially right now. Come on now. And I just want to say my heart goes out to you guys. Just be strong. You know, I've been through the valleys of the shadows of death Amen. many times. Amen. And I'm not giving up. Not giving and up. I don't want you guys to give up. You know what you're saying is easy because I'm not in that situation right now. I'm not in that situation. But my heart is in pain because I know the situation of things crumbling down. But you don't have to break. You build Tell us your name, sister. My name is Lorraine Moreland. And I where am are a, you from? Los Angeles. I'm a skid row artist. Okay. See? I was on the news of February 14th this year for Black History. I love it. So if you want to check me out, go on Channel 4 News, 4 o'clock, 6 o'clock on February 15th. I, I'm a skid row advocate. I make things happen for skid row. Amen. You know, because I was homeless for eight years in a doorway. Lord Jesus. And let me tell you something. When people come help you, you better be ready for the hell. Don't say you're not ready. Because they need the help. Well, thank you. Thank you so Absolutely. much. Thank you, beautiful with us lady. On Radio. We love you for what you do. God bless you. I'm going to go over here and I'm going to talk to this sister. And uh, I'll be back. Okay, guys. So we're going around the room just talking to beautiful black women. And we are just, we're just in the, we're in the, we're in the hook right now. It just, you know, just being around wonderful, powerful black women. It's, it's, it's a spirit where when you're broken sometimes, it takes another black woman to heal you just by the presence. Sometimes your illness can be healed just by being around other black women. Sometimes you need to be around them because they're the only ones that can really identify with what you're going through and say the exact thing to help you just get over that hump. So I'm here because this is what I do. I shine light on light. <laughs> so we're here right now. Please, I'm going to go around the table and talk to all of you. Tell, tell us your name, sister. My name is Yoga. I'm with Girlfriends Unfiltered. And Lisa invited me to come speak with everyone to tell them about Girlfriends Unfiltered. Girlfriend Unfiltered is a platform on Instagram. And I interview authors, black women authors, to tell our stories, put our stories in books. This is about empowerment. It's about togetherness. It's about love. Um, we have a, actually a really, really big event. We have 30 authors coming in from all over the United States on September the 16th. So I'm just excited. I'm excited to be here to share my story and my journey about how Girlfriends on Social got started with everyone today. Well, we look forward to hearing your story. How can we get in touch with you to follow your work, sister? I'm at, at girlfriends underscore unfiltered. And you can also reach me at info at girlfriendsunfiltered.com. There you have it, folks. Girlfriendsunfiltered.com. We just spoke to a powerful sister. We're going to go around the table and have them, uh, you know, tell us about ourselves. We have none other than celebrity photographer. I'm not going to butcher her name, but she's, she's an OG. She's original, not old. She's an original that this is, if there wasn't her, there would be no us, first of all. Second of all, half of us trying to be her, we'll never be her because they don't make women like that no more. 
it's a different era, different woman. And I'm here to celebrate all or all eras of women because we all bring gifts. But today I'm celebrating you. Please, I don't want to butcher your name. Tell us about you, what you do, and who you are. Hi, I'm celebrity photographer Donna Donnelly. I'm a photographer to the stars and to the community and to whoever else wants to use my services. I'm so blessed to be here with all these wonderful women, all these black queens. Let's celebrate to the wonderful black queens in our community. Thank you, God. Thank you. How can we find you if we want to hire you for services? You can find me at Facebook at Donna Donnelly Photography, Instagram, same, and LinkedIn, Donna Donnelly Photography. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you for being you, and thank you for being here, and thank you for dropping gems for us. We're going to go ahead to the next young lady. I don't want to butcher your name, but I'm so excited that you're here with us today. Please tell us about you, who you are, and what you do. No problem, Kim. Hi, this is Maya Dimely, interior designer and also assistant to Donna Dimely. And today we're here celebrating Black Queens Matter at Fixins downtown. And what a lovely celebration to get together frequently or not frequently with all black queens celebrating our achievements, big, little, or small. Nothing's too big to give a handshake and a praise. Yes. So on this lovely Sunday, what can I say? Come out all queens. Yes, come And come out. celebrate with us. We love you. Thank you so much. How can we find you? Because we want to keep in touch. Definitely Facebook at Maya Dimely, D-Y-M-A-L-I, or LinkedIn at Maya Dimely. Y-M-A-L-L-Y. Hope to connect with you. Thank you so much for interviewing with us today on iHeartRadio. WKAM 61.1 iHeart. We'll send you the link when it's ready. You've got to linger. Thank you. We're going to go over here now to the good doctor, y'all. we got a doctor in the house. We're coming on over to you, doctor. we got the doctor in the house. we got the doctor in the house. Kimberly Jessica reporting live today from WKIM 61.1 iHeart. We got the doctor in the house. I'm not going to butcher her name. She's a black queen. Here we are. Tell us who you are and Thank what you. you do. Thank you, Kimberly. Live. My name is Anya. Um, I wish I'd known I'd be speaking to you guys yeah. right now because I am a little tipsy. But it's Sunday. It is Sunday. It is my opportunity to come out and interact and have fun. I'm so grateful that my neighbor, best friend, girlfriend shared this opportunity with me. Um, it's just um, another opportunity for black women to get together and celebrate each other and how wonderful that is. Yes, right? it is. Um, there's nothing greater. Nothing better. Nothing better than Does awesome. everyone have a mom? Every, exactly. Hello. Exactly. Should we honor her? And should we honor ourselves? And that's what we're here to do. And honestly, this room is full of black queens. They are absolutely beautiful. It's just I'm, a wonderful experience just being here with you. It is. Oh my God, you are so doctor. beautiful. <laughs> Um, I really don't have a social media presence. Okay. You know, I'm in the clinic 24, okay. 24, um, not to say 24 7, but I guess sometimes it feels that way. Anyway, um, I don't have a private social presence. It, uh, that's understandable. As of yet. Yeah. Um, so when that. Uh, when you're ready, you reach out to me and let me know. Absolutely. Yeah, and I'll put Thank it up. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. <laughs> well, guys, we're going to interview a couple more women, and then we're going to call it a wrap for the evening. Um, oops, we don't want to call that out. So we're going to talk to a few more women um, so they can tell us where they're from, who they are. Uh, we have I Have Radio. We, which one of these beautiful black women would love to be on the radio quickly to talk about how you are? You're the lucky gal. Let me come over to you. This is Kimberly Jessica reporting in live today from iHeartRadio for the Black Queens Matter. And we're just reaching out to different beautiful black women like you guys. This is our first time. This is beautiful. So tell us who you are and what you do and what you love about the, this luncheon. I am Renee. Nice to meet you, Renee. Um, I have a small business. I'm a small business owner. I uh, retired for four years. Wow. And uh, just enjoy sisterhood. Nice. That's really what you like best about Black Please Matters, the sisterhood. It's the sisterhood. It is. Yeah. Getting together Coming and breaking together bread. And positive attitude. Yes. With wonderful women. Very positive attitude. Yes. Yeah. And tell us who you are, ma'am. My name is Marilyn. Nice to meet you, Miss Marilyn. And I'm free and easy. She's free and easy, Miss Marilyn. And it today is, a... is my birthday. Oh, how old? How, how young are you? I am 66 years old. God bless you. Six, excuse me, 68. God bless you. Today, I keep Happy forgetting how old birthday. I am. Happy birthday to you. Yeah. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday.
Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Yeah. If she said I'm 68, I said 66. Whatever. Whatever. You alive. I'm alive. Yes. And I'm here. Yes. And y'all should, whoever y'all are, live as long as me, honey. Yes, ma'am. So tell us what you like best about this Black Queen's Luncheon, Mama. The food. The food. My friends. Yay. Taking me out. Yay. And all of that. Thank you Just so life much. in general. For taking the time to be with us on your birthday. Thank you so God much. God bless you. And I pray. And I know that you're, you've got at least another 30 years. At least. So, at least another 30 years. I'm we, working we, at Yes, 30 years. No question. Yes, another 30 years. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to be celebrating your birthday again next That's year. That's right. Mark no question. Words. I love you, Mama. I love you too, Thank baby. you, sweetie. All Thank right. You. That's it. Thank you. Well, this is Kimberly Jessica reporting in live today from My Hot Radio with some of the dopest chicks on the planet. I'm in love with y'all black women. We love you. You are loved and you are appreciated. And we acknowledge you. Because if it wasn't for y'all, us, there would be nothing. Nothing. So I want to interview. I want the world to know about y'all. This beautiful woman. You're so pretty. You know that. You know you are, though. She knows she is. And I, that's why I like it. Because she, she know it. And she's like, what? And look at her face. How pretty you are. Long, pretty, curly hair. You Look at you. Girl, come on. Come on. Tell us who you are. She's a model, y'all. <laughs> well, my name is Tanisha. She's real pretty. <laughs> real pretty. So tell us about you, what you do. Oh, um, I work for Medicare, Medicare uh, advocate. Okay. I do insurance. So she makes sure we healthy and we got coverage. There okay. you go. Um, I'm single. Okay. No kids. Okay. That's, she's single and no kids, y'all. We got NBA players here. Okay. We're going to pass this out. Yes. Yeah, and we're going to get a picture of you, too. Okay. Yeah, because you're real pretty. You oh, need to be you. out there. We thank love you. you. I appreciate what did you like best about this luncheon today, sister? I just like all the women together, black women together, yeah. enjoying food, no drama, just yes. happiness. and loving music. on each other. Amen. That's what, I just love loving on people. Loving on, yes, exactly. What's your name, sister? My name is Tanisha. Tanisha, you're dope. Oh, thank you so much. And we on iHeartRadio, WKIM, FM 61.1 in Los Angeles want you to know how pretty you are. Thank We're you not so just much. saying it. You, we're going to get a picture. I'm going to show y'all something oh. right quick. All right, y'all. This is Kimberly Jessica reporting in live. We are shutting down, but thank you for being with us today.